Welcome to race 15, the Miller Lite 200. Now here's the first three lap shootout for the drivers that are outside of the top 20. And Marcus Ambrose, he's won the first race of this little outside of top 20 series. Can you get another one? And Trevor Bain sadly starts last, but he has the strongest car in the field today. Now gentlemen, start your engines. Here we go, lap one is underway. Marcus Ambrose. Already diving to the inside of Jeff Burton. Trevor Bain deep in the field. Paul Menard having a struggling season. He's going to lead lap one. And we got a caution. Oh. Ruderman and Keselowski both hard crashes into the inside wall. Joey Logano involved. David Reagan and David Ruderman. And here we go. Final lap. Paul Menard. And speaking of Bain, he somehow makes it to the front. Here he comes. But Marcus Ambrose, he's going to get to the inside, and Ambrose is going to win the three-lap shootout. What do you think of that? And now for the big boys, the Miller Lite 200. Starting first today, Martin Truex Jr. Second, Carl Edwards in 99. Third is Max Kansas. Fourth, Greg Biffle. And in fifth, Gino Harvey in the Chips Ahoy machine. Love that car. Case Kane, starting sixth. Whoa, naughty word. Seventh, Dale Earnhardt Jr. in the 88. He's on a roll this lately. There's Jamie McMurray. Ninth is Tony Stewart. He's doing pretty well. Juan Montoya starts 10th today. 11th is Jimmy Johnson. 12th, Bryce Harvey. And the Nike Lego car. 13th, Mark Martin in the 5. Starting 14th, Ryan Newman. Beautiful picture, taken by yours truly. 15th, Kyle Busch. 18. 16th, Clint Boyer. Also another good picture. <laughs> 17th, Kurt Busch in the 22. 18th, Denny Hamlin. 19th, Heth Gordon. 20th is Kevin Harvick. He starts last. And now here's for the command. And the engines have been fired here. And we are getting ready to go green. Green flag racing. Truex leads the field down uh, for lap 1 of 12. Truex going to lead lap 1 it looks like. And he does. Kenseth moves into the second position. And Johnson goes to the inside wall. Mark Marhart in the wall. Ryan Newman. Boy is involved. Gordon and Harvick look at that stop on the track. Kyle Busch was in the air. Kurt Busch was in the air. And Ryan Newman was also in the air during that caution. That was a hard wreck. See, Kurt Busch, he's on top. It was Newman. There's Jimmy Fonson. Mark Martin's in the crash. And Kyle Busch. Ouch. And then there's Bryce Harvey. That's so sad. See, Gordon and Harvick on pit lane. They made it through the crash, so they will stay in this race. Here's an instant replay. Oh, see Newman. In the air, Kyle Busch gets flipped over, and Kurt Busch as well. And now we go back green, lap 3 of 12. There goes Martin Truex Jr. He's got this, it looks like. Lap 4, Martin starting from the pole. There has not been a driver that started from the pole and won yet this year. Matt Kenseth to the inside. Here comes Matt. Look at the inside, here comes Gino Harvey. He moves into second place. Harvey to the inside. Oh boy. Lap 7 of 12. It's gone on board with Gino Harvey. Around 3 and 4. He gives the inside open. Is he going to take it? Oh, he pulls away, it looks like. Lap 8 of 12. Harvey pulls away, but here comes Kenseth. Dale Jr. all of a sudden in the third position. Now into the second position. Last week's winner. Can he win back to back? I don't know. Matt Kenseth. He has never won in the Athlet Cup Series, ever. Can he get his first here today? He leads with three to go. Junior peeks his nose to the inside. Can't quite do it. And Kane goes for a wild ride and up to the turn. Looks like Jeff Gordon might have crashed in there. Hard incident for Casey Kane into the wall. Such a shame. Here we go, lap 11 of 12. Two to go. Kansas gets loose. Here comes Gino Harvey to the inside. And he's going to take the lead with one lap to go. Harvey finds his way to the front. But Kansas is glued to the bumper. 
Jay McMurray's in the picture now. Here comes Drag Race. And it looks like Matt Kenseth has won this race. How about that? Well deserved burnout, Matt. Do your thing. Congratulations, Matt Kenseth. Here's an instant replay. There's McMurray in the picture. Couldn't quite get it. But there's Matt. And it's going to be a drag race. Bam. Trading some paint. That's how you do it in Athletic Cup Series. Mm, look at that Mountain Dew voltage. Tasty. By the way, Matt won. And then Harvey moves in first into points. How about that? He definitely deserves that. Dale Warner Jr. Fifth is Martin Truex Jr. Sixth is Carl Edwards. He's barely in the chase. Can he stay there? Carl Edwards. Or it's not Carl Edwards. My bad. Tony Stewart. There's Jeff Gordon. Kevin Harvick. Tenth place, Greg Biffle. He needs that, but he's just a little short. Now, Juan Montoya, he is so, so close to that chase. He finished 11th at the end of the regular season last year. Once again, he's 11th with one race to go after this. Bryce Harvey, this is a killer race for him. He's so close to making that chase, but oh, that, this race killed him here. He didn't need that wreck, but Mark Martin wreck, that's good for him. So did Denny Hamlin, a lot of these chasers that are close to chase, like Ryan Newman, Denny Hamlin, Mark Martin, Bryce Harvey, all crashed. Now, if Juan can just win a race, he could get in this chase. Yeah, it's kind of a hard task to ask for Juan, but he can do it. I believe he can. There's Marcus Ambrose, once again, winning both top 20, behind the top 20 races this year. Trevor Bain, so close to winning. He almost got it. Paul Menard, he gave everything he had. It's just really hard to protect that bottom sometimes. Jeff Byrne, he's got to win. He's had a struggling year, though. David Reagan, he almost got a win this year, but was taken away by Mark Martin at the last second. Brad Keselowski, he did really good at Michigan, too. We'll see when we get back there. There's David Rudeman, and Brian Vickers finishes last. Hope you enjoyed this race, everybody. It's JG24, JM26, signing out.